Welcome back everyone. Welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Apocalypse. Once again, I've forgotten to actually uh, start the next building. <laughs> Uh, to research, but it doesn't really matter because at this point we don't really have any big uh, threats towards us, apart from maybe a raid or something. The Senate is pleased with the performance of XCOM and has increased funding accordingly. We uh, now have over a million, and after expenses, we still have over a million, so that's lovely. And this is taking a long time to research, it's actually at 100%, so let's see how... How many minutes after I click ultra fast? 55, okay. The alien city is a complex organic growth in which each building type functions as a highly specialized organ. The megapod chamber is the repro uh, reproduction organ of the alien city which nurtures numerous egg-shaped structures. These megapods are giant seeds which grow to a large size before being transported to a new location. The seeds then grow and develop into other alien buildings. The Megapod Chamber is extremely well defended, but once it is destroyed, we will be close to victory. Alright, well, um... Let's go and say hello to them. Once again, as per usual, a few of these guys with the... Oh, it's right there. It's very nice of the aliens. Listen to that music. That's really creepy. I like that. You'd think that, um... <clears throat> I should have done closer to midnight, but okay. You'd think that with the, uh, imminent demise, the aliens... Or as soon as we started destroying their buildings, they would have shut off the, uh, dimensional portals. But... Maybe they can't? I don't know. Okay, more... That eh, doesn't matter. We don't really need anything more. So, off we go. Still no aliens. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, they are so done. They are so dead. Alright. There we go. Lovely jubbly. And raid the building. The megapods are the means by which the aliens create new structures. The small egg-like objects are eventually replanted and grow into massive organic structures. Our discoveries are shocking. This building is practically overflowing with pods. Our scientists fear that the aliens are planning a massive expansion, and who knows how we could stop them then. All megapods must be destroyed, thus preventing the aliens building any new structures. So basically, what the Micronites did was... They were impatient. Before expanding, they just said, ah, we can just take them. Let's just, uh, let's just invade. And yeah, that uh, kind of didn't work too well in their favor, I suppose. All right. Get everyone ready. Uh, if I remember correctly, uh, this is one of the slightly more annoying missions because... Uh, there's a lot to this map over there. Because the megapods, uh, I believe, are slightly hardier than the rest of the stuff we were usually destroying. Uh, oh, there's a Cymorph there. And, uh, yeah, a lot of it sometimes is left. Uh, well, you know, there's when, when there's explosions going on, a lot of the times some of them will uh, still keep standing these megapods so let's see don't really care about that guy but I might be wrong I don't quite remember in fact we're gonna we gotta throw it like this over that and then it's gonna bounce off boom, 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 boom. okay that was actually very lovely I wasn't expecting it all to go and interestingly enough the cymorph didn't die it's uh, quite weird can you hit him from here Yes, you can. Just go on auto. Look at that accuracy. So let's see how many times we need it. So he took that explosion. Holy moly. Don't really know what these things are supposed to be, but hey. Alright. We can throw a muffin here as well. Just to get rid of this spawner. No! Ugh, darn it, I hate that. Bye! Gonna throw that here. No, that, okay. Might actually destroy. No, it didn't. And it did not destroy the spawn. 
point. Are you kidding me? Let's see. How can I get this now? Can I get it now? No. Can I get it now? No. Ugh. Do I have to go down here to get it? No. No, I didn't. No, don't end the turn. Jeez. Okay, there it is. But I cannot pick it up because it's seven per pickup. That's really annoying. Okay, so we need one more. Oh, yeah, you've got gas grenades, so never mind that. <clears throat> right, next team. Where are you guys? In relation to everyone else. Yeah, that's an okay position, I suppose. The good thing about these uh, megapods is that it's usually very easy to, uh, to spot where they are growing them. Because, well, they need a lot of space and they're usually bunched up. So, that's a good thing about it. Another muffin, s'il vous plaît? There we go. Throw that right over there. Lovely. Oh! I like that. Yeah, that goes to the uh, megapods there. Okay. Let's keep going a little bit. Next team. Fly, please. And uh, you're here. You might as well go a little bit this way to cover all the areas. Okay, yeah, there's megapods down here. Um, there's gonna be megabots in there. I suppose we'll just go down here then. Fly, please. So the aliens are in some real trouble now. Well, they've been in real trouble for a while now. But yeah, now it's... It's pretty much dawned on them, I think. Or maybe it's done so uh, before as well that... This is it! They are not going to have a galaxy-spanning empire, the, uh, the Micronoids. Which, if you think about it, if this was real, would be uh, very much terrifying. You would have your mind taken over by these microscopic things. Uh, there's no entrance to this thing. Okay. Fair enough. Don't really want an entrance then. Fine. Keep your entrance. I don't want it. Alright, we might actually see aliens now because, well... Yeah, there you go. Big boy! Is he actually gonna shoot? Probably not. Really? You're gonna shoot the devastators? It's not gonna do much here. And he's cloaked! Now the only bad thing about this, of course, is that they will, uh, the aliens will spread out, making them more annoying to actually try and get. Uh, but, uh, yeah, we're still gonna do it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry! Alright. Let's go for this little building here. Is there an entrance there? No, not quite. We could make one, I suppose. But no, why Why be rude? Let's just uh, go where the actual entrance is. There we go. Oh, big spawner. Uh, right, you've got these. And you've got muffins, right? You've got one muffin. And also a gas grenade. But I just want to destroy the spawner here. Most likely will not destroy, <coughs> excuse me, will not destroy the rest. Oh, oh, nice. Oh my god, it's going for these as well. But these ones have... <laughs> Holy moly. That was lovely. Um, oh, I forgot to pick up the Toxigun. I think we'll get it back. Doesn't matter. We got a bunch of them anyway. That was lovely. Uh, right. This area. No, don't, don't waste the time units. Okay, so. Hello. This <laughs> is the bloody machine gun. Universe and time matter. Alright. Let's activate. And... Oh. Boom, 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 boom. Oh man, it's so satisfying. Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. Uh, it gets a little bit annoying. How much to throw? 15, perfect. Um, gets a little bit annoying when 
You're trying to get them all. Let's go the, here. Oh, no. That was, yeah. I should have gone down a level. Oh, well. I was kind of hoping that it wouldn't fly that far, but oh, well. It did. It did. Okay. Not to worry. We've got plenty of muffins. Uh, let's throw... Well, I Oh, because that's how it works. Okay, I see. Whoa. He suddenly spotted a bunch of them. Oh, there we go. Uh, well, how about here? Have some. No, oh, come on. Keep going. Yeah, see, that's kind of a problem. You know what? Actually, let's do a gas grenade there because there's quite a few of them there. Uh, it's probably not going to get all of them. No arc of throw. Why not? It's right there. Yeah. Okay. Well, eh, not the best, but it's serviceable, I suppose. Alright. Get in there. Please don't waste time units. What about this side? Anything on this side? No. So it's just that side. Oh. One more muffin here. Now, should I throw it there? Yeah, let's throw it here. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. Although, again, that gets rid of the alien gas, which is not great. But, oh. Uh, we will most likely need a smoke grenade, so I'm just gonna throw one uh, preemptively. Oh. Well, that, that works. All right. Next team. Uh, where are you guys? Oh, you're here. Excellent. Um, yeah. Can work with that. Don't even need that uh, smoke grenade then. So well, that's lovely. All right, muffins. Muffin time. There's one over here. Should be lovely. Boom. 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 I'm not sure if you actually need to destroy the little ones. I think you do. But, oh well. Um, another gas grenade, maybe? Hmm. Uh, not for now. I'm just gonna shoot a few of these, I suppose. Come on. Oh, <laughs> killed another one there. There we go. And those ones should die from the gas. Come on, you've got one more shot. Nah. Uh, control Alt. Alright. More muffins, I suppose. Actually, we could test it and leave some of the tiny ones there. But I do believe you probably need all of them. Will it destroy that one as well? It will not. Yeah, see, that's... That's why it's a little bit annoying. That uh, anthropod did fall unconscious, though. Oh, well, that's nice. Come on. Lovely. Okay. So another one there. You've got two more muffins, which is excellent. Um... Yeah, there's a bunch of these things here. Oh, a bit too far. Oh, <laughs> these things are still there. How? One more muffin. Uh, I'm gonna throw it at that one. I don't really think that the big ones are... Uh, I mean, the small ones are required. Look at that all. Jeez. Yeah, that gas grenade was kind of overkill, I suppose. All right, next team. There's a bunch of stuff here. It's a really big area as well. Look at that. Lots of little mushrooms. Let's go over here. And throw some more muffins. Alright. Muffin time. I like how this uh, peaceful music is playing while we're absolutely destroying the place. Uh, somewhere over here. Maybe too far for that one. Yeah. So annoying. 
Uh, you could just drop a muffin here. It's gonna hurt our shields a little bit, but it's no biggie. There we go. And then we can destroy that one as well. And let's see if that... Oh no, because there's more stuff. Oh, come on! See? Because it sometimes if it gets stuck in something, uh, it actually doesn't propagate the damage around it. It's, it's very weird, but yeah. And very annoying, of course. Alright. There's more here, so don't throw it directly at the stuff. Yeah, again. Darn it! Okay, fine. We're kind of running out of muffins now. Uh, yeah, these guys will need to get over there and help. And these guys... Oh, they're on this side. Okay, you know what? Uh, I suppose you can throw a muffin over. But also check this area, make sure there's no uh, respawn points. So yeah, how about you throw a muffin? Let's see if you can throw it right. Oh geez, there's stuff all over the place here. Not very good. Come on. Oh, I didn't destroy many. Yeah, I suppose this is where a Devastator would come in handy, maybe. Uh, I might actually pick it up from one of the aliens if we didn't just destroy all of the Devastators. Which is very possible, of course. Alright. I think there's nothing else for the moment, so we have to end the turn. Brain suckers, maybe? No, that was a skeletoid. Somewhere. Where was that skeletoid? Probably cloaked. Ah. Ah, uh, no, that's a spawn. Alright, let's just go one by one first. Uh, there's some big ones here. So let's see, if we get rid of these big ones, will that mean that it's... Oh, yeah. But that's that. Do you guys still have any explosives? I don't think they do. Oh, you do. Excellent. Just what we need. And these big ones are much nicer because they explode quite nicely. Uh, I just hope it's going to affect those as well. Come on. Come on. Uh, come on. Come on. Ah, not those. Our building has been disabled. So, indeed, this was fine. You don't need those small ones. You don't even need these ones. Just the very biggest ones. Okay, so, uh, there should be a Skeletoid somewhere as well. Let's just get rid of this guy first. Oh yeah, you've got the missiles. Oh, another one just... yeah, there you go. Um, don't have any explosives. So there should be a Skeletoid. And I think he's gonna be around here. Right? This team will look for him. Or maybe it's a cloaked one in all of the smoke. There we go. Yeah, it is here. Because remember, this guy was the one uh, firing his Devastator at us. Unfortunately, because he's in the air, we have to actually try and hit him. Oh, no, there's more. Okay. Hmm. There's more. That's going to be a bit annoying, because all of this smoke... Ah! A panicking big boy. I don't... Have I ever seen that? Probably. And that was it. Panicking big boy. You know things are going bad for the aliens when those monsters start panicking. <laughs> Holy moly. And... Boom! Nice. That was cool. And this is it. We just have the dimension generator or whatever it's called uh to do and yes i immediately need to research yeah reveal a weakness in the alien defenses man this was good we are unhappy with the recent activity of organization nanotech yeah fine even though it's 87 uh, but now they're probably uh neutral yeah they are uh, let's see what Cult of Sirius has done, rebuilding their stuff. Yeah, they're slowly rebuilding their buildings. And let's also see their money. <laughs> Minus 180,000 balance. I love it. Uh, 
Oh, that's, that's just nice to see. Oh, and this is still right next to our base. Very handy. Thank you, aliens. They are nice after all. Oh, yeah. No space for the mega spawn. We don't really care. All right. Attack, nano attack, mega pole, cyber web, member life tree attack. Everyone is just fighting each other. It's, yeah, it's crazy. Let's just select everyone. And give them a muffins, because we've pretty much... Well, we haven't exhausted the supply of muffins for the teams, but uh, yeah. There's been... Uh, there we go. And you've forgotten your Toxigan. Um, yeah, we've used quite a few. Also, let's just do this and get everyone a gas grenade, because those things are amazing. There we go. The only downside of gas grenades is that um, they do not produce an immediate effect. And by that, I mean, when you throw a muffin, something can die immediately, because, you know, it immediately deals damage. But the gas weapons, including, you know, stun grenades and so on, don't actually deal damage until it's the alien's turn and they move through the gas. Which means that, you know, it can be a little bit iffy. If you're in a bad spot and they've got dimensional missile launchers or something that can hurt you, uh, because if they stand still and start shooting at you, they could shoot once or maybe twice before they actually die. Um, so that's the only downside, I suppose. Our final mission awaits our forces. This building sustains the three dimension gates, which create a direct connection with our dimension. Soon after the building is destroyed, the dimension gates will fade away and the link with the alien world will be broken forever. The aliens will be vanquished and victory will be ours. I don't really know how this sponge creates the dimensional gates, but uh, yeah, it is called the dimension gate generator. All right. Well, we're going to destroy this thing next time. And thank you very, very much for watching. Have a good one. Bye-bye.